Yahweh is my light and my salvation. Whom shall I fear? Yahweh is the strength of my life. Of whom shall I be afraid? Welcome to 23 Streams, and thank you for spending time here today for this prayer for strength with scripture and meditation. Our prayer is to be a resource to help you connect and have a personal relationship with God. We have resources to help you connect with God throughout the whole day. Short prayers and guided meditations like this that are great at any time. Music sessions with scripture for worship, focus, or soaking. And all night sleep with God's word videos. When you're done with this session, check out the other resources on YouTube or our website. A daily gratitude practice is a great way to connect with God. It also has many proven health benefits. The daily prompts and Bible verses in our six month daily gratitude journals are a great way to start or end your day and focus on being grateful to God. The link to get the journals in the description. In today's meditation, we will do Lectio Divina. In Lectio Divina, we go over the same verse three times with space in between for you to connect with and hear God. God tells us to be still and know that he is God. And in this silent time, it might feel like you're not doing anything. But that's when we can hear him the most. We'll have a one minute pause between verses. Just follow the prompts before the verses are read. Now we'll get into our prayer for strength. We'll start off by taking a deep breath to calm our souls. Lord, for all of those listening now, I pray for strength for whatever they are dealing with in the name of Jesus. Lord, you are a good God and you love us. Through your son, you have given us eternal life. We forgive all who have wronged us and ask for your forgiveness as we come before you. Lord, may your strength root us down and give us strength. You are the rock of our salvation and our homes are built on this strong rock of whom shall we be afraid i pray for both physical and mental strength for all those that are listening i pray that you open up the ears of our heart to hear your word this morning during our meditation so that we can be filled up by you you have told us to be still and know that you are god being still in you is where we will find our strength Lord, for those that are listening that are feeling weak physically, I pray that you give them a fresh wind and an energy for today. If there is healing that needs to happen, I ask for healing in the name of Jesus. For those that are feeling weak mentally or defeated, I pray for renewed hope, for renewed motivation, and for renewed faith to get this going today. I pray that they lean on you and your promises and not in the depression of the past or the anxiety of the future. Today is a day that they will live for you and be a peace of bringing heaven on earth. In Jesus' name, amen. As I read the scriptures for the first time, just listen and feel the word of God over you. Psalm 27, 1 through 6, W.E.B. Translation. Yahweh is my light and my salvation. Whom shall I fear? Yahweh is the strength of my life. Of whom shall I be afraid? When evildoers came at me to eat up my flesh, even my adversaries and my foes, they stumbled and fell. Though an army should encamp against me, my heart shall not fear. Though war should arise against me, even then I will be confident. One thing I have asked of Yahweh that I will seek after, that I may dwell in Yahweh's house all the days of my life to see Yahweh's beauty and to inquire in his temple. For in the day of trouble, he will keep me secretly in his pavilion. 
In the secret place of his tabernacle, he will hide me. He will lift me up on a rock. Now my head will be lifted up above my enemies around me. I will offer sacrifices of joy in his tent. I will sing, yes, I will sing praises to Yahweh. As I read the scriptures the second time, bring awareness and mindfulness to anything the Lord is highlighting and offer them to God. Yahweh is my light and my salvation. Whom shall I fear? Yahweh is the strength of my life. Of whom shall I be afraid? When evildoers came at me to eat up my flesh, even my adversaries and my foes, they stumbled and fell. Though an army should encamp against me, my heart shall not fear. Though war should rise against me, even then I will be confident. One thing I have asked of Yahweh that I will seek after, that I may dwell in Yahweh's house all the days of my life to see Yahweh's beauty and to inquire in his temple. For in the day of trouble he will keep me secretly in his pavilion. In the secret place of his tabernacle, he will hide me. He will lift me up on a rock. Now my head will be lifted up above my enemies around me. I will offer sacrifices of joy in his tent. I will sing, yes, I will sing praises to Yahweh. As I read the scriptures the third and last time, ask God about the highlighted things. If he's calling you to do anything or to anything. Yahweh is my light and my salvation. Whom shall I fear? Yahweh is the strength of my life. Of whom shall I be afraid? When evildoers came at me to eat up my flesh, even my adversaries and my foes, they stumbled and fell. Though an army should encamp against me, my heart shall not fear. Though war should rise against me, even then I will be confident. One thing I have asked of Yahweh that I will seek after, that I may dwell in Yahweh's house all the days of my life, to see Yahweh's beauty and to inquire in his temple. 
For in the day of trouble, he will keep me secretly in his pavilion. In the secret place of his tabernacle, he will hide me. He will lift me up on a rock. Now my head will be lifted up above my enemies around me. I will offer sacrifices of joy in his tent. I will sing, yes, I will sing praises to Yahweh. Thank you, Lord, for your goodness and grace. Thank you for what you've highlighted today to all those listening. Help us rest in the truth of your words. In Jesus' name, amen. Give us strength, Lord. You are a good God. Thank you, Jesus. Thank you for being here. If this helped in any way, please like the video as it helps us get found by more people. If you're looking for more Christian mindfulness, click over to see our full channel and playlists or look down in the description. God bless you.